Hey guys, it's Kelly. Um, I don't know if Jesse's uploading today. You know, it's almost 4 30. He's still could upload like 5 o'clock. He has before. But, anyways, um, if you can tell by the title of this video, I have an idea for new app. I was thinking about it in bed last night when I was trying to fall asleep. And yeah, so I kind of have it written on paper. I don't have a name for it or anything yet. I just kind of want to give you guys a basic idea. So, it's like basically it's a texting app for like YouTubers, like, you know, Twitch streamers. Pretty much like in the title, one has like something chat possibly in the title. So yeah, the point of the app is like it's to be able to you know talk to your favorite YouTubers, but you know I know you can be thinking Kelly, what about like DMing and stuff and email? Well, you know the the YouTubers, you know they never respond to email and stuff. So like this is the way so it can kind of be a personalized conversation too between you and YouTubers. So pretty much how, when you first get on the app. Um, you download it up and you and you click on it, and then pretty much what it would be like, you just have to put in your number, which no one else will be able to see your phone number, it's just a formality, like the app kick, when you have to put in your phone number, but you know, obviously, and people that you message can't see, it's just, you know, a formality since it's texting them. Put a number and then you put your name, it could be like your name, and then there'll be also a section too, if you're a Twitch or YouTube, where you can click that, and then put your channel name, and you have to do other steps to that. Um, so yeah. And then we'll verify you to see because we'll know if you're lying about it. You can't just put on oh, a YouTuber. I don't see why you would lie about them. But we'll check, you know, we'll verify your channel, verify that it's you. Um, but yeah. Oh, I don't know what today's date is. What's today, guys? No, let me go over here real quick. Let me check on today's date. Because today is. Okay, I just want to double check, so I want to put this in a corner now. So, it's no, so it's June 4th, 2019, and I came up there last night on the 3rd, I'm going to type the word, so yeah, see, I want you guys to, so you guys know in case someone else tries to steal it or say it's theirs, there's some proof, I don't like, but as you've seen this video that's recording, I wrote it down. So yeah, so yeah, pretty much that's basics, and then you put your YouTube logo. Um, I have some pictures I'll be showing like at the end after I explain it, just so you guys can get a visual of it. Now it's just not anything set in stone, just this what my idea in my head for it. Um, so yeah, and then you can put like your profile picture um, or whatever, or like you know for the YouTubers and Twitch streamers, they could put they put their like YouTube logo so we know who it is um and, and when i can tolerate if, um no one else can be using the youtuber's name like you can be the juggernuggets one or the juggernuggets two you know or like big brother one or pewdiepie one like actually i don't know but anyways yeah that's how it is walking so then you can click on your profile or like any other profile and you can see kind of like in the way to like we're following and follows but this one you can see received messages or just say received and it says the number that's how many mis messages have been sent to the person and then there'll be section then on the other side you see sent that's how many they have sent to people and then you see one-on-one -on -one, which would be in between them two and then that says how many one-on-one -on -one messages they have um and then pretty much you, when you're on your profile, you can slide to the left, you can see, it would say home, group chat, so you can do a group chat with a bunch of people, like YouTube, YouTubers could do, decide to do a chat with everyone, could be a part of it. Um, and then underneath that would be one-on-one, -on -one, so if they want to choose one-on-one. -on -one. And with the one-on-one -on -one thing, that's going to be like for verified, um, the YouTubers can choose. So what they can do is like, go to your name and click one-on-one -on -one chat and do a one-on-one -on -one chat with you if they want, just you and the person. Um, like I said, details are not worked out, so, I mean, don't be asking too many questions about it just yet. But, I mean, you guys could ask questions, it's not like, a lot. I don't have details worked out, it's just a rough idea of it. And then way at the bottom, you can just, just do delete your account. Um, so, yeah, pretty much I want to do, you, you could go to messages, click on the message, you know, hold it down, then a, a menu pop up that would say either 
one on one chat. Actually, no, one on one chat should be in there too. But should we say delete? Um, delete flag. Oh no, not flag. It should say delete. Report. Report. Copy paste that stuff, and then you click delete, and then it's like delete messages or delete combo. You can delete certain messages, like on regular texting on the iMessage on iPhone. You can just you know choose to delete certain messages, or you can hit delete combo, and it would delete the whole conversation with you and that person. And then with the whole flagging system, I have an idea for the flagging system. How it would it would go to the people and us of the app would choose to see, and you can either. Um, Oh, reporting, I mean, not flagging. Reporting is how I want it to work, because it's, um, it would go to us, and then we can redeem how we find it, and then you either, you lose, if you, you get, um, strikes, maybe? Actually, we can do strikes, like, three strikes, if we get three strikes, then you can lose the app, um, you know, but you can lose app privileges, you'll be kicked off, you'll lose your account, um, your account will be banned, and yeah, you know, and then one strike can result in, like, a week suspension, once you get two strikes, you, you get a month suspension, and then three strikes, you're out, you get your, um, part ban, um, that's just an idea, I keep saying number one, that's just an idea of how we're putting to um, correct how we deem it. I feel I want it more to go. We deem it. if we deem it really terrible, then you know, then yeah, you can always send it to the proper authorities if we think it's threatening or kick you off or suspend you. You know, that's you know, like I said, nothing set in stone. You just decide there's I really want to do this, and I think it's a great idea. Um, but yeah, and the YouTubers and church will have the little check mark to be verified, you know, next to the name. And stuff so yeah I it's I think it's a good idea for now because you can make you and you also can talk to other people like in the group chat you can choose to like do um you know talk to the fans of other youtubers so like you guys can get along um, but yeah that's how it's gonna work and then so yeah, that's how the one and run works, and then if you're not a YouTuber, you're just a fan, or just a regular person on the app using it to talk to the YouTubers, you can talk to the fans as well, and but the one-on-one, -on -one, that can work with any fan, um, but you cannot do that with a YouTuber, and that option will not be available, unless and, unless they choose to do it. So I think with that way too, if they choose to do it, it makes it more like meaningful for you and the person, like, makes it more like, makes you feel more special, it's like, oh, this person wants to just talk to me. You know, you could get to know the person and know the fans and become friends. Because I've always heard, like, oh, I met this girl in school in my town, in my neighborhood. That's also a fan of this person, too, of, you know, KPI on camera, PewDiePie, Jesse, McChuggernuggets, you know, and we became friends. So I think that, you know, that could be fun. Like I said, this is all needs to be worked on. Nothing set in stone. It's just a rough idea. I just have to come with the name, logo, everything like that. You know, I think it's a great idea for an app. Like I said, we'll be making um, tricks to it and, you know, tweaking it. But yeah. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think in the comments. Let me know if you have any other ideas for the app. I would love your guys' input. You know, and yeah. And if you guys could give me advice of how I can go about actually making this real, too. If you guys have any advice on that, what I could do to make this a reality, let me know. Uh, yeah, if you want to give me name ideas, there's for you feel free to but you know I'm not saying you have to just if you want to um I don't know what the logo could be I want to be something cool to do like Twitch or YouTube I don't know I, I was thinking you chat but that's too close to YouTube I don't know I just wanted to do something so the name and the logo could be something relevant with Twitch and YouTubers because Twitch streamers I know are big too and just people make a living off that so yeah, I think it's going to be a great app, and let me know what you guys think in the comments. 
share this video, like and um, follow me on my social side, my YouTube petition, follow Colin on Insta. Um, oh, and yeah, and the pictures, yeah. You have been seeing them already. Um, as I'm explaining it, I'll probably have him pop the pictures up. So yeah, Colin, as I'm explaining how the setups are going to work for each thing, I want you kind of put what I'm envisioning. Just kind of, I want to try and give you what I'm envisioning for the apps to look like. Like I said, I need you guys' help. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of the app. Let me know how I can go about making this a reality because I have no idea. Apparently, Colin tried to create an app, but I don't know. Reach your standard. Hit that subscribe button, guys. Let's grow this channel. Because with this app, too, I'll make it for even the small YouTubers like me, like other ones that have under 1,000 subscribers, under 100,000, you know, under 100. I want them to be able to be verified, too, as, you know, on this app. I want them to feel special. I want them to know they're important, you know. And I think this app's a good idea. And like I said, Anyways, guys, yeah, so hit the subscribe button, the post notification bell. Um, I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.